Hey friends, it's Shauna from With Love from vinyl.etsy.com where I make and sell glitter tumblers and offer ready to use water slide decals. Um, we're going to try something new today. I was looking through YouTube and came across a video that a company had put out. The company actually makes water slide decal paper. So it was a tutorial on how to use it. I don't remember the company's name um, and it wasn't a brand that I've used so I wasn't very familiar with it. Uh, but they were doing the video and I noticed that they did the placement different from what I'd seen on any of the other videos or how I'd seen anyone do it before. So I wanted to give it a try because it could be like super easy for some of you to do it this way as opposed to how I've been doing it. And I wanted to see if it actually works. So everything else is pretty much the same except for how they put the decal paper onto the tumbler. That is the only thing that's different. So if you decide you like this way, you're going to have to mirror image everything because it's going to flip all the wording and everything around. But everything is the same as far as putting the paper, the decal in, room temperature, water until the backing gets uh, released from the paper. Now keep in mind the backing isn't going to actually come off of the paper. It's just going to slide around. It's going to be too soon, um, but it's starting to wiggle. So it's going to stay on the paper when it's in the water. I had someone message me uh, earlier today because there was some, they were a little bit confused on the paper coming, the decal coming off of the paper while it's in the water. We want the, the decal to stay on the paper while it's in the water. We just want it to be sort of released so that it's just slippery. Um, you don't want to handle it too much, but I'm, <laughs> I'm impatient. So I'm really just trying to see if it's released yet. Um, this cup has been epoxied twice, but it's a cup that I just keep around anytime I want to test a new water slide design. And then, I mean, I put the water slide design on and then take photos of it, make sure everything works. Um, you know, all the coloring is right before I list it or offer it for sale. So this cup is, that's why there's no, um, tape or anything that's not going to get finished, which is kind of sad if I actually end up loving this. We might need to finish it, but that is why it's the way that it is. So everything else is the same. You see how that wiggles on the paper. It's ready to go. We have taken and put water onto the cup. The squeegee I will have linked is available for purchase on Amazon is where I get those. I'll link those in the um, comments, but I had to try this. So everything else is the same up to this point. Normally I would have put the paper on this way, angled it where I wanted it, and slid the paper from behind the decal. This company actually puts the paper on this way, applies some pressure. Oh, look at it. It's already coming off. And then slides the decal off. The decal paper off. Oh gosh, that's pretty too. Oh, dang it. I should have had the tape on so we could that's gorgeous. And that was super easy. Everything else is the same. So we're taking the squeegee now and pulling the water out from behind. Okay, I'm digging it. All right, I like both the, um, the decal and that way of applying it. Now keep in mind, if this is the way you decide to go and you start applying it with the decal paper being slid off from the front side of the back, Everything you do is going to have to be mirror image. So if there was words on this, um, if there was words on it, we would have had to do a mirror image print so that the words would read the right way. Actually, if you want to hang on for a second. And everything else was the same, where you pull the water out with the squeegee. And that's a gorgeous decal. Oh, I'm going to have to list this one. All right, let's do something real fast, though, since... I'm sorry, I have... Yeah, that's really pretty. Holy smokes, Masticelli. Hang tight for a second. I'm going to grab a decal with words so that you can see what I'm talking about. Okay. All right, so this is one with words, which normally we would put in the water, put on like this, slide from the back. Um... But if you go this method and you want to do it sliding um, the paper off of the decal, 
I do like this way. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we're going to have to make some changes then to give you guys the option. If you are ordering water slides from me, you'll have the option then if you want it mirror imaged to do it this way. For now, leave a note in the note to seller section that you want it mirror imaged so that um, you can do it this way. And then I'll go ahead and edit my listings at some point to offer it as a as an option during checkout. You can choose which way you want it printed so you can apply it whatever way is easiest for you. That was really cool. Now, doing it this way puts all of the, the print on the side closest to the cup. So as you're maneuvering it around, you also don't run the risk of rubbing any of the design off. Because sometimes if you're rubbing too much, that design starts to... I mean, it's a delicate, delicate decal, so now I just can't stop playing with it. All right, if you've hung out with me for this long, it's a longer video than I intended to do, but that's really cool. So I want to show you guys. Okay, so same thing with the cup. And this decal, will not, we're, not, we're not using this for real. I just want to show you what I mean by reversing. Okay, so I'm just putting some pressure on, kind of getting you know, a, a little bit of a suction of the decal to the cup so that when I slide the paper off, the decal stays behind. All right, my new favorite way to do water slide decals, but do you see what I mean? I'm not going to go through and get the water out of this one, but do you see what I mean by having to reverse it? Because now all the words are backwards when you apply it this way. Easy fix, but if you get words and it's not printed in a mirror image, you're going to have to put it on with sliding the paper off of the backing. I mean, just, you know, plan ahead. I have to pay attention when I print them, how you guys want them printed. So if you're ordering water slides from with love from vinyl.etsy.com and you want to do this way of applying the water slides, just make a note in the note to seller section that you want it mirror imaged um, until I can get those changes made to the listing that'll give you the option during checkout so that all of the wordings and everything, all the images are facing the right way. If it's an image like this, it obviously doesn't matter. Gosh, that's a gorgeous image. But um, if it's words or if you want, you know, if you wanted the flamingo to face the way it was originally designed to face, then we would need a mirror image of that. Anyways, if you have any questions, let me know. I'm going to go ahead and take this one off because, well, we can't keep it like that. It wouldn't be very good if it was all backwards. This one we may end up having to keep because I really, really am digging that cup. We might have to make this now a... Uh, for sale cup. We'll see how it turns out in the morning. If you have any questions, let me know. I appreciate you guys watching and thank you so much. Have a great night.